Who are you? And what do you want? I want your life. My life belongs to me! I didn't say otherwise. I only said I want it. If you know that you're a man and you want my life, drop that bow and arrow. Then come. Come! And let's do it. Man for a man. Come! So be it. Something is definitely wrong somewhere. Someone is after my life. And I must get to the root of it. I must find out who the person is. And when I do, that person will feel my wrath in a way that has never been heard in a manner that has never been seen. this bed and you got me scared. your friend and he's like a brother to you there is no how he could possibly wish you harm let alone harm you eventually <laughs> so it is <laughs> the nightmare looks so real yeah that is what you get when you drink excessively yes yesterday i tried to caution you to stop drinking but you told me that being awarded an all you were Call for celebration and more celebration. You're right. Yes, I had so much to drink. Mm. I'm sorry. It will happen again. I will keep reminding you of that. I don't want you to follow me. Chicken. Yes, Your Majesty. Where is the king? He just left the palace. To where? I have no idea, Your Majesty. You have no idea? 
Chike, the last time I remember, he was still his chief guard. You go to wherever he goes, you know where he goes. So what happened? Your Majesty, I think he doesn't want my company today. Were you able to speak to your father before he left the palace this morning? No. Where did he go to? I wouldn't know. But it's strange that he left the palace without his chief guard. Mother, this is not the first time Father is doing this. Don't you think something is wrong? I have no idea what is wrong. <sighs> Mother, please talk with Father. Sit down with him, heart to heart. Try and find out what is happening. Something is not just right. When father tends to act like this, we should get worried. Something is not normal. Please, mother. to worry about. See, it's it's a win-win situation for everybody. Uh-huh. Yeah, the, the money in this deal is too much. What if I got me a more money? Yeah. Everybody will get a share. I will all be happy. Alright, it's a clean deal. On there then I over can I all right, alright. Um give me some time I'll call you back. Okay? Uh, just a few minutes I'll call you back. Okay. The international or you mogul. Okay. Who can I go? My prince. Okay. Bro. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. How are you doing? How is your angel? She is fine. Okay. Uh, she's okay. Uh, she's doing well. No, no, I'm awesome. My, see, I spend money on my woman. I spend I money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Money. <laughs> Good to see you, bro. Good to see you. Good to see you. Uh, Chill. I know exactly what you want to do, but I'm not just in the mood for that now. For real. Are you scared? Scared? I'm still young one. I'm not here for this. Uh, <laughs> all right, all right, no problem. What's up, bro? Um, actually, I came to remind you of our agreement. Agreement? Have you forgotten? Are you owing me money? Okay, I like it. Because if you're owing me, give me immediate. Don't you me? Let me go. It's not about money. Uh, Am I owing you before? Yeah, sure, you're not owing me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so which yeah, agreement? By the way, I came to remind you of our agreement. You're supposed to accompany me to the village for this year's New York Fala Festival of my father, your king. I, I am so sorry. Too many things in the head. Why, Alupiko? I, you okay. told me. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Is that, when? When is it? On the 28th. 28th? Yeah. Hold on. Wait. In two days? Exactly. Aye. See, <laughs> you can't you now. What do you want to say? You see... <laughs> okay, fine. You win. Your Fala Festival, here we go. That's, that's the point. <laughs> no problem. That's my man. I'll be there. I'll be there. <laughs> okay, whoa, whoa. My friends. Uh, no yeah, that's good. That's good. Aha. That Remind reminds me. Good news. Okay. Our company just won an oil well. Mm -hmm. It's a wonderful news. Big money. Big cash. It's very good. <laughs> <laughs> My I think now I'll drink. Now you drink, yeah? Don't worry, don't worry, sit down, sit down. <laughs> <laughs> 
That's me calling. Me calling. Me calling. I'm in the mood right now. Your Highness. Don't worry, Your Highness. Ojadili sees beyond the spirit. I know about the nightmare. Great one. Who is after me? Your Highness, don't worry. The masked man will soon be unmasked. You should be bothered about the remaining sacrifice for the Ofala festival. Izoba need more blood. Great one. I have never been found wanting in discharging my responsibilities to the great Izoba. And it won't start now. Your Highness, you are right. But time is of the essence. Your Farah festival is in two days time. Which means you have just tomorrow to provide the remaining heads for the sacrifice. And you know whose heads. Great one. I... Tonight, my voice will make ready the heads. Good. And... One more thing, your Highness. Don't bother about Ezemo. Ezemo is just grasping on a straw. I will feed his body to the vultures that disturb the peace of the sky. You should be bothered about the sacrifice. Go and get them ready. Wise one, consider it done. Go. Go. I am determined that this our community will be crime free. This young man you see standing with me is the face of the new security outfit of this community. I have empowered them to roam through the length and breadth of this community to search every nook and cranny, every house, every cottage in this community until the perpetrators of these violent ritual killings are brought to justice. And this young man too, they are to provide security at the forthcoming of Fala Festival. Your Highness. What a, is it? What is it? I have a question to ask. Your Highness, have these people been vetted and approved by the government? You are mad. I mean, you are seriously mad. Look at you. You claim to be an Ichie in my kingdom. Just look at you. You think with your anus and you excrete with your mouth. I am not bothered about this, the stupid question you have just asked. I am bothered about what is in your head. Whether the maggot from your father's grave has taken the essential nutrient in your brain. Yes, I'm sorry. Oh, shut up! Sorry for yourself. Now this meeting is over. Get out. Get out, all of you. Go. Get out. All of you. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Boys, you are now free to roam the length and breadth of this community. Enter their houses, search it, take whatever you want, do whatever you want to do with them. Hmm? We are at your service. 
you will enjoy our service. <laughs> Congo man, Igwe. <laughs> Is that a question or an interrogation? I'm your wife. I need to know, is there anything going on that I should know about? Can you do me a favor? Oh, what is it making? <laughs> I need to be left alone. Honestly speaking, you're beginning to get on my nerves. You left the palace this morning without your driver and chief guard. Is it not strange? Huh? And what gave you the authority, the audacity to talk to me like that? Have you forgotten that you are in the presence of a sovereign? Really? Oh, let me stand well. Have you forgotten you are in the presence of the queen of this land? Oh, please. I'm only trying to be a good wife here. Woman, leave my presence before something strange happens to you. Hello, <laughs> Dibe. Whatever you're trying to hide will soon become a public knowledge. Open secret. <laughs> <laughs> It's just a royal celebration. I'm sure there's nothing fetish attached to it, believe me. Okay. I'll still have to think about it. All right. Fine. But while you're thinking about it, remember that the prince uh, and his wife will not be happy if you don't come with me. There you go again. Must you blackmail me with how they will feel? Don't say that. I'm not trying to blackmail you. I'm just telling you the truth. Remember we're family friends. Hmm? Okay. You win. I'll go with you. Oh, see, that's why I love you. <laughs> so you're happy now? Mm -hmm. Can I sleep? Now? Of course, you can sleep. Okay. Good night, my love. What are you doing? What? Uh, I, I was just, just checking something. Wait, what are you checking? See, the truth. Who want to take a dick at you? see Are you just seeing it for the first time? <laughs> no, no, I'm, I'm, not just, I'm just appreciating my investment. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, stop. Please, I want to sleep. You don't like this part. How long are we going to stay in the village? Um, just two days after the festival. Then we return to the city. Oh, nice. I just can't wait to witness this festival for the first time. Mm. <laughs> it's gonna be great. Yes, yes, I can imagine. <laughs> yeah, um, did you invite your friend? Fred? 
Yeah, Fred. Of course. He'll be coming with us. Oh, that's nice. It's going to be interesting. I just can't wait. <laughs> can't wait too. Yes. Hmm. It's going to be great. You know, you've talked so much about this festival. Mm -hmm. So finally, I'm going to witness it. <laughs> you will enjoy it. I know, I will love it. <laughs> so, we'll get um. to the village. Please, where is Norma and Juju? Norma and Juju? I don't know, I thought they were with you. No, I've been with the princess all day. Where could they have gone? And it's getting late. Though. This is strange. Such has never happened before. It beats me. It's okay. My princess, what is it? Why are you crying? What happened? What is going on? Talk to your mother. My chief made it. Norma. Mm -hmm. And did you? Mm -hmm. Our dead mother. What? <sighs> they were gruesomely murdered, mother. Oh no. Oh no. So sorry, my love. So sorry. I can imagine how you feel right now. Knowing how well you loved Norma. It's not about how I loved Norma. It is about this killings happening at the eve of every fall of festival, mother. Can't you see there's something wrong? Can't you see? Oh. Your Majesty. What am I hearing? Father, why is there always ritual killings at the eve of every of our festival, Father? Why? How dare you ask me that question? Do you know the amount of effort I put behind the scene in order to apprehend the culprits and bring them to justice? Then Father, do more, please. Your best is not just good enough, can't you see? <laughs> Father, the best honor you can give to those who just lost their lives, no man might order me the new Jew, is to just cancel this Ophala festival. I can see you have lost your senses. Woman, Bring your daughter back to her senses. It's okay, calm down. Mother. Yes. I want to be left alone. Would you have no problem with anyone? If a mama surprised as you are, Nima was so peaceful. Huh. Me, I'm scared though. It can be any of us tomorrow. God forbid. <laughs> it's not my portion. In fact, I'm out of here. Mm -hmm. God. Going I'm going to my friend's house. I'll be back shortly. Uh, yes, I hope uh, you got, bought the things. Uh, yes, I bought everything. Okay. Eh, uh, brother, I saw the prince in, a, in his convoy on my way coming back. Wait. You mean you saw the prince? Yes, now I saw him in his convoy on my way coming back home from the market. Wow, this is awesome. That means tomorrow's Ophala will be very, very great. Yes, of course. Wow, this is good news. Uh, I'll be back. Okay. I'll be back in the Jiffy. Uh, 
don't stay long. Go. No, 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 no. Very soon. No, you jump. I won't stay long. Yeah. I'll be yeah. back. Okay. Bye bye. Take good care of the house, eh? No problem. I'll be back. Who is there? Hold on. Hey, my lovely sister. <laughs> my lovely prince. Wow, look at you. <laughs> wow. How are you? I'm fine. Welcome home. Mm, you're good. Thank you. You do too. How was it, Jenny? Uh, it was good. It was okay. great. Nice to have you back. So, how are you doing? How's your health? How are you feeling today? My health. Yes, how are you feeling today? Mom told me that you're not feeling fine. Is that what they told you? What's going on? My chief maiden and one other maiden were murdered in cold blood yesterday. So, everything is not fine. I won't pretend like it's fine. But it is tragic. But I promise you that those people that are responsible for that must be apprehended and put to justice. Okay. Um. So, can you tell me what's going on? <laughs> Only a foolish animal dares the lion in the jungle. Wise men know when to throw the towels and accept defeat. SMO, get out of my way, you defeated old fool. Oh, Jadili. <laughs> The commonest proverb is The stubborn fly follows the corpse to the grave But that is the strongest The blood of the innocent are waiting for justice It is but for a short time The gods will rise Old Fool, you don't know the gods. When you see Ojadili, you have seen the gods. I am the gods. Ojadili Mechonogi. You are only but a little child. Listen. Ukure Ruru Walong. Ah, Mechonu there. Keep quiet, old fool. Let me warn you. I will eat you raw. I will deal with you. Oh, Jadele. <laughs> oh, Jadele. I want you to prove your spiritual prowess and walk past me. <laughs> Ezembo, you are daring me. You are daring me, this old fool. Remember how I used to handle you in the past. Get out of my way before I lose my temper. Out of my way. Ojadele, I give you a simple challenge. I expect you take it. Esemo, akana gani kembembe. Ogotalaro, oga otanse. Get out of my way. Hey! Where are you going? Hey! 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 Ha 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 ha!
Oh, Jadele! <laughs> you are a little boy. You are a coward. Great men, don't run. They stand and fight. It is only the cowards that run. Show yourself. Where are you? Oh, Jadele! Come and fight. You are running. Abomination! Hey! I or Jadele running away from Ezemo. When you have Ezemo? Hey! I must find out where his god is coming from. Hey! Okay, look at what name Hey! 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 Tell me, why do you prefer to stay in the family house instead of here? It's my whole one's house. But, Mama, Mama, you know you would be more comfortable here. I can't be comfortable anywhere than my husband's mansion. Tell them. Mama. But it's true now. Tell them. But, Mama. Mama, don't tell me you're not going to change your mind. <laughs> My love, don't bother yourself. Hmm? Believe me, we've been through this over and over again. I tell her the same thing all the time, but never. She only comes here when I'm around. Once I'm not around. Uh, that reminds me, when are you going back to the city? Once your final festival is over, the next day, we're gone. Yeah. You mean you put came back because of your father festival? Mm hmm. <laughs> the prince is my very good friend. I suggest you go back first thing tomorrow morning. Yeah. Why? What's going on? Terrible things happen during the Ofala festival. Eh? Ritual killings, kidnapping, and so forth and so I don't want it to have anything to happen to any of you. Biko. Mama, like, like he said, once the festival is over, we are off to the city. Nothing will happen to us. Please, so don't add one more day. Just leave. Once it's over, go back to the city. My daughter has a problem about that. Mama, you make Yo yo Hey Hey Sir, I for me. Yes, yes, I did. Sit down. That your friend. What is his name? Fred, Dad. Fred. How well do you know him? Dad, I know him too well. He's like a brother to me. Really? Mm. Um, did he offer to come to the celebration freely or... No, I invited him. At first, he declined because of his busy business commitment. So I had to prevail on him to come because I don't want him to change his mind. Daddy, it didn't sound as if everything is okay. Oh, no, um, you know. Son, you know, we are royalty. And a lot is happening these days. We must be very careful. We need to know whom we can trust and those that we can't and should not trust. Mm. But you don't have to worry yourself about Fred. He's a nice person. You're sure about that, aren't you? Yes, I'm sure. But I have to rest now. Okay, sir. I'll be in my room. Good night. Okay.
Today is the day we all have been waiting for. <laughs> that was a good performance by the Umwane Dinamba Kotora Group. Ladies and gentlemen, I crave your indulgence to introduce to you the man of the day. An icon. A paragon of integrity. <laughs> no other man than... <laughs> uh, Let us rise and welcome His Royal Majesty. Igwe Cosmos Ilodibe. Omwa the first of Umunze. happened like what you left the palace unannounced i went to attend to something very important yeah. something very important yes that's very unlike you 
meaning? Go and get me something to eat. Who's there? Who's there? Oh. How are you? Fine, sir. Welcome, sir. Where is your guy? He's inside. Go and tell him that Ono is here and it is urgent. Five I don't understand no. Why are you calling me your highness? You said it before and you just Because okay. you are supposed to be our king. Me? Yes, I believe you are hearing it for the first time. Of course. You were young when your father died. Probably you didn't know what led to his death. Your grandfather was our king. And your late father, the crowned prince. The way your late grandfather died, your late father was supposed to take over. Okay, so what happened? You know they be bullied everybody with his money, influence and power. Your father was killed out. He has nobody to speak on his behalf. I was the only one who opposed Ilodibe. But his dogs, his bad boys, threatened to kill me, to waste my life because of my justice. So when I saw you at the palace, I chose justice over my life. You have elders that are in line with tradition that can help you fight over what belongs to you. Yes. Um, oh no, I need to verify this. I don't understand your highness. Who else knows about this? Hey, all the elders do. But loyalty might hinder them from telling you the truth. I can get the sure KK on our side, on our side, and we'll start from there. Yes. But let me tell you. If I lie to you, I believe your mother cannot lie to you. Yes. Let me take my leave. All right, sir. Oh, please, just before you leave, let me give you something. Okay, you just have this for transport. Eh? Then my wife got dragged me. No. Okay, I have it. Then. Mother, is it true? What are you talking about? Don't act like that, Mother. You know what I'm talking about. I believe you've been standing here long enough. You saw me. Is it true, Mother? What happened to my father? Huh? Talk to me, Mother. What happened to my father? Then why are you acting that way? Talk to me, Mother. What happened to my father? And why are you crying? Mother, I need answers. Why do you always discourage me from coming home? Huh? Why do you prefer staying in the old house, our village house, instead of this mansion? Why? 
Anytime I talk about coming home, you tell me not to come home. Why? Even when I talked about the, 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 the Fala Festival, your mood changed. What's, what's the problem? Talk to me. You really have to take it easy on Mama. Please, I beg you. You need to stay out of this. Please, stay out of this. Mother, I need answers. I couldn't tell you anything about your father because I know you are going to go for the throne. You know, you know, is a very wicked man. And I can't afford to lose you. I can't, I can't survive if anything happens to you, my son. Hey! No matter what you should have told me, mother. Hey, come on. You're talking about how many years? 10, 15? Much more than that. You should have told me, mother. It's, it's my right to know. It, it's okay. What is it? Mama did what she thought was the best for you. And it is only a loving and a caring mother that would do that for her son. Then why would you talk to me like you that? You have to appreciate her and cut her some slack. Huh? No, talk to no, talk to me. I, I, do you smoke? Why would you talk to me in that manner? Are you supposed to be on my side? Before you judge people, try and put yourself in their shoes. And before you judge me, put yourself in my own shoes. I mean, my father was killed when I when I was how old? Seventeen. Because he was poor. He was supposed to be king and he was killed. My mother didn't even tell me. How am I supposed to feel? Then go ahead and crucify her if that will make you feel better. Mama did what she thought was the best for you. Please. You have to stop flippanting over trivia issues. What? You disgust me. The throne of my father. Greetings, father. Greetings, mm. son. You called me. Oh, yes. Yes, I did. I did. <coughs> um, when is your friend going back to the city? Um, first thing tomorrow morning. Is there any problem? Um, no, no, no. <laughs> Not at all. Uh, just, um, I would have loved to appreciate him for coming to my Ophala festival. And then um, beyond that, you know, he he <laughs> he actually contributed to making it um, very very lively, you know. Uh, Father Fred is um, very busy. It took me time convincing him to come with me. Oh, oh, really? Uh, does it mean he he doesn't like coming to the village? Uh, not really, you know. He has this. Uh, Western mentality, you know. Yeah, he has a very different mindset. Oh, okay, all right. It's okay. It's all right. Uh, okay, brother. Okay, um, let me go back to my room. I'm actually tired. I'm resting. Exactly. You worked hard for it. <laughs> yes. <sighs> Hey, hey,
every wilderness has a road this is a good window of opportunity for me to get to the next level and i must utilize it i must utilize it Nine. what are you still doing outside at this time of the night please come let's go inside and sleep do you need my eyes to sleep with yeah. i need to be left alone i'm thinking can't you think yeah. so you can let you want to think about what <clears throat> Woman, go and sleep. Leave me alone. That's the curriculum. When you are ready, you can come inside. No problem. Now the dots have connected. The nightmare. The strange feelings I had before I left the city. The king stared at me immediately I mentioned who my father was. All connected. I'm going to fight for what rightfully belongs to me. See you tomorrow morning. There's something important that I'd like us to discuss. It's okay. Okay, fine. See you tomorrow. you felt was best for me. And I love you so much. You're my mother. The best mother in the world. It's alright. Mm -hmm. You're the best son. The best mother anyone could ever have. <laughs> Honey, what is it? I just got off the phone now with Fred. He didn't really sound good. And this is the first time he's calling me by my name. That he called you by your name doesn't suggest anything. Babe, my instinct is psychologically active. That is more than a call. What did he say? He said he would like to see me in the morning. There is something he wants us to discuss. Then he hung the phone. At this point, I don't know what to say. In the morning, you need to meet up with him and know what it is.
<laughs> Wait, Collins. What did you just say? Because I don't believe you. Emmanuel, what I told you was just simply the truth. I went to the palace this morning and confronted the Igwe. You did what? Do you want to die prematurely? God forbid. It's not my portion. Certainly. But, do you know how dangerous that man is? My friend, I know. I know how dangerous King Iledebe is. I also know that he's behind the ritual killing and all the atrocities that befall in this community. But it's high time he's exposed. My friend, I understand how you feel, but you are trending on a dangerous ground. I understand you just lost your brother, but you have to be very careful. Emmanuel, I'm very careful. I'm very, very careful. But I've never been afraid of King Ilodibe. And I also know that, that nothing will happen to me. You don't have to bother yourself. I'll be fine. Thank you, my good friend. I'll good. see you later. I'll, I'll, I'll. So what are we doing here? <clears throat> Many years ago, we met. Some boys wanted to attack me. You showed up and you saved me. After that, we became very good friends. I even found out that you are the prince of my kingdom. Since then, we formed a very good friendship. It has lasted for quite some time. 
But something happened, and it's about to challenge the very fabric of our friendship. I don't really know exactly where you're driving at, but as far as I'm concerned, you are still my brother and my very good friend. Like I said before, something happened. And where we go from here depends on the decisions we make right now. Go on, I'm listening. Has your father ever told you how he became king? Okay, um, he said the king died and he was chosen to succeed him. Mm. Yeah. Is that all he told you? Fred, honestly, I don't know where all this is driving at and I'm just done with this conversation. I brought you here because many years ago an injustice was done here. So to correct that injustice, something also has to be done right here on this ground. My father was supposed to be king. Your father killed my father and took his throne. Now I'm back to take what rightfully belongs to me. I know your father. He will not leave without a fight. And I am ready for that fight. So I want to ask you, are you standing with me as a friend? Or are you standing with your father? You are sick. You are sick in the head. of my people, the sacredness of tradition, hey, for the peace of my people, for equity and justice, I will fight for the throne of my father, the throne of my father, I will fight, hey, I will fight for my best right, hey, I will fight. 
see the crazy the guy the go, don't worry. This wicked man, so it has got into this. The only reason I will not cut your tongue off your mouth is because you will use it to answer these questions. Because the time you walked into my palace and insulted me, I knew that you were not acting alone. You had other co-conspirators. Now tell me, who are those conspirators and what are their names? You are afraid of your shadow. You know, small boy, a lot of people live this life without making a choice of the date they will live the life. Other people make choices for them. They don't know because they have involved themselves in matters that are way and high above them. Matters they cannot comprehend. I ask you for the last time, tell me, who are your co-conspirators and what are their names? I don't know why God gave us such a wicked man like you as a king. Go ahead and kill me. But I show you one thing. You will never get away from this. Wicked. Congo, Igwe, kill this man, make him die miserably and slowly. I have urgent and important matters to address. Igwe, wicked man, wicked man. Oh, wow. This matter, I will run now. So, it's not for the big game. So, good morning. How are you? Mama, what do you think he will do? I have no idea. But I think he's going to fight for the throne. And that is my fear. Mama, don't worry, okay? If he comes back, I am going to prevail on him to let the sleeping dog lie. Huh? Please do, oh. Talk to him. Because that Igwe is very, very wicked. The man is capable of doing anything. Mama, I will handle him. Don't worry yourself hey. over that, okay? Please, let's go inside. Hey. Yo, yo. Hey. I, hey, hey. Fathers, my throne and my bed right, the leadership of my people, the sacredness of traditions, hey, for the peace of my people, for equity and justice, I will fight for the throne of my father, the throne of my father, I will fight. Hey. I will fight for my bed right hey. 
Baby, good morning. Good morning. How was your night? There was no night. He said I disgust you. So I spent the whole night thinking about it. I'm really sorry I said that. I guess I went offline. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm going to forgive you on a dinner date as soon as we get back to the city. Still going back today, right? Well, from the look of things, it's obvious we will not be going back soon. I believe you know why. Yes, I admit I do. So what are you going to do about it? I will do all I can to reclaim my throne. Honey. Honey, you were not destined to be a king, but a king maker. Yes. The king is only influential here in the village. But your influence is across developed cities. Please, don't tell me you are considering fighting for the throne. And again, baby, Prince Jules is like a brother to you. Just tell me, how is he going to feel that you've come to fight his father over the throne? Please. This is not about the throne. It's about justice. For the peace of my people. For equity and justice. I will fight for the throne of my father. The throne of my father. I will fight. I will fight for my best right. Hey. Greetings, Yaris. Oh no, Yaris. What is it that cannot wait? Yaris, there's a problem. Ah. Sit. Thank you, Your Highness. So, what is the problem? The young man who came with your son to the Ofana festival invited the whole elders to the village square this evening. What? Yes. Are you sure of what you're saying? Your Highness, I'm sure. I, I'm, I, I'm an elder now. I got the invitation. Do you know who he is? Oh no. We have a problem in our hands. That young man is the son of the late Igwe of this kingdom. What? Silas Ugezo. What? Oh no. Go to that meeting. Hear what he has to say. Then come back and bring me words. Consider it done, sir. I'll go there. <laughs> We are going to have a problem. I met with my friend and he said a lot of things. What did he say? Father, he said you killed his father just to ascend the throne. And he's coming back to take over the throne. <laughs> I asked you about that guy. And you told me that he is Mr. Nice Guy. Didn't you? Father. Did you kill his father? No. No, I didn't. Okay. Suffice it to 
admit that his father was supposed to be the king of this kingdom. But the people did not want him. He was poor, uneducated, wretched, he had nothing to do. And so the people chose me instead of him. Son, how is that my fault? Hmm. I knew it. I knew that Fred is a green snake under the green grass. Father, leave him for me. I'm going to handle him. Son, this battle is bigger than you. Father, the battle is not bigger than me. There is no battle that is bigger than me. I'm face it. Son, take your wife. Go back to the city. Leave Fred to me. Father, no. I am not going anywhere. I will not go anywhere till this battle is over. I will not. Fred is not only coming back to take over the throne, but he's coming back to take my position as the crown prince of this kingdom. I am not going to allow that to happen. I will not allow it to happen. I will fight him to the last drop of my blood. I will. Mm. The son of a lion is a lion. So, we fight him from all angles. Mm? Long live your highness. Your highness. My boys respond quickly to my command, your highness. Yes, your highness. Yeah. Whoa. I am. My others, I greet you. You are welcome. Uh, first, I want to thank you for this honor. I really appreciate it. I'll go straight to the point. I was 17 years old when my father died. Uh, but even at that, I still knew how it happened. And uh, as of that time, I knew tradition very well, up till now. My grandfather was king at a certain time. And then he passed on. My father was supposed to take over, but my father was poor. He didn't have the funds to, you know, do what he was supposed to do at that time. Chief Ilodibe bought his way to the throne. Today I'm standing here to say that it is time for that injustice to be corrected. It's time for what is rightfully mine to be given to me. So please, my elders, if there's anything that should be done, tradition, culture, whatever it is, I'm here to plead. Let it be done so that my throne will be given to me. Thank you. Hey, the throne of my father, my throne and my bed right, the leadership of my people, the sacredness of traditions. Hey. For the peace of my people For equity and justice I will fight for the throne of my father The throne of my father I will fight hey, I will fight for my bedroom hey, I will fight What are you doing here? I'm here to see your father, Chief Ilodibe. Leave and never come back again. Okay, I'm listening. This is not about you, okay? We've been good friends for a very long time. 
We don't have to spoil our friendship. Not anymore. We are not friends again. What is going on here? Greetings, Chief Cosmos Ilodibe. What did you just call the king? You are king! It's okay, Sam. It's okay. <clears throat> you have the audacity to come to my palace and insult me. I am not here to insult you, Chief Ilodibe. I'm here to tell you the truth. The throne you are sitting on does not belong to you. It's my throne. You have seven days to vacate the throne, or I will declare myself king. And as you know, there cannot be two kings in one kingdom. Listen, boy. You are treading on a dangerous ground. Don't start what you can't finish. I've started it already, Chief. And I will finish it. What you just said now, I've heard it countless times from my business adversaries. And I always win. You have seven days. Leave here and never come back again. Waka. Never come back again. <laughs> Baby, what is going on? Everything happened before you. Fred and his wife are now our enemy. What? What is what? What, what? I said Fred and his wife are now our enemy. So cut every ties with them. Babe, please tell me. I, I, I don't understand. What is really going on? As you can see, I am not in my best of mood. Please, do not make it worse. Please. I can't cut ties with Bella with no justifiable reason. I understand that Fred disrespected your father by the way he addressed him. But the question is, why? What gave him the boldness to come here and contest the throne? Are you, are you mad? Mind your business. Stop saying what doesn't concern you. Mind your business. You slapped me? And don't push me to do that again. Don't push me. Are you deaf? I said, leave me alone. I will not leave you alone. Until you tell me what is going on. I'm your wife for crying out loud. I'm the queen of this great kingdom. So tell me what is going on. Woman, I have had enough of you. Get out of my room. I am not going anywhere until you answer my question. I asked a simple question that demands an answer. So just give me the answer. And I will go. Why would that boy come here to lay claim to the throne? Are you sitting on someone else's throne? You are getting on my nerves. You are getting on my nerves! Get out of my room! Get out! No! I am not going anywhere. Until you answer my question. Remember, I am also involved in this matter. So answer me. What is this? You want to know the truth, right? Okay.
result is at stake now. And I don't want you to get involved in this. Please. I will fight this fight alone. So please tell your boys to stay down. Okay? I don't want anything to be traced back to you. Please. No, 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 son. No, no, no. If your men get here, tell them to stand down. You hear me? I don't want the police to be attracted to this. Yeah. We need to trade with caution. Your friend appears to be prepared. Father, please do not address him as my friend again. He's now my worst enemy. Yes. And if you must listen to me, let's take him down once and for all. No, no, no. No. If we do that now, we will be the prime suspect. We need to follow this boy with caution and study his capabilities. Hmm? I think you're right. Tomorrow, you and I will go and see Ojadeli together. Who is Ojadeli? <laughs> He is my backbone. We need to consult him in case this war goes spiritual. <laughs> brother did this to you? <sighs> Why? He asked me to cut out ties with, with Fred and his wife. Ella is my best friend. I told him I can't and he slapped me. Listen to me, Mary. I want to talk to you like a sister. If you know what is good for you, run away from this marriage. As long as your leg can carry you, as fast as I can carry you, run on. What? Why? Bella is my best friend. This is all I can say to you now. Go and think about it. <sighs> Miriam. Please. Do not let my brother hear what I just told you. Don't tell him, please. If you do, it will be your word against mine.
of my fathers, my throne and my bed right, the leadership of my people, the sacredness of tradition, hey, for the peace of my people, for equity and justice, I will fight for the throne of my father, the throne of my father, I will fight. I will fight for my best right hey. I will fight I will fight for my best right What happened? You've not been taking my calls You have to leave for the city tomorrow You and Mama I am not going anywhere without you oh, My love, do not argue with me, please I cannot guarantee your safety here yeah. What is going on? Prince and his father have declared war and I will not be bullied by anybody. So you have to leave tomorrow. You leave with Mama, okay? Please. Do not argue with me. Just listen. Get up, get up. This is not necessary. You have to go. I cannot guarantee your safety. You leave for the city tomorrow with Mama. Baby, can you just please reconsider your position? Please, I'm begging you, baby, please. I have made up my mind. Okay? My son, please, I beg you. Hello Dib is a very, very dangerous man. Am I no. And then, if you know, why don't you just forsake the throne? Leave the throne, I eh? After all, God has blessed you with wealth. I know. God has blessed me, but I will not leave that throne. And I'll tell you why. Our father was robbed of his rights because he was poor. God has blessed me. I have money now. The best I can do to honor our father is to get back that throne. Okay? So don't try to convince me. I've made up my mind. You and my wife will leave for the city tomorrow. Why? Because like you said, Mama, Ilodibe is a dangerous man. And I wouldn't want him to hurt my family. I'm not going anywhere. I will remain here. Whatever will happen, let's stop here. Ever can go. Can we not be making My friends, I hope you all know why I called you here. My friends, we are soldiers. We got your invitation, but we didn't bother to ask why because we know there is war. There is war actually, but not that kind of war we fought in the university. Blood is blood, war is war. My prince, just give us the details. Let's clean sheets. I hope you're well equipped. For sure, now my boss. Eh? Everywhere soft. <laughs> Without correct machines, war is lost before it begun. Confirm. It's okay. Nice to hear that. You go back to the hotel and stand by. No shaking, my prince. Yeah. I When the war is over, can't you see what Fred is planning? 
or don't you want to be the future queen of this kingdom? I am not ready for any more. In fact, I am not interested in any royal position. Tomorrow, I am leaving for the city. You are not going anywhere. I am your wife, not your slave. I still have right. Miriam! Don't push me. Just because one riffraff came back from nowhere to lay claims on the throne of my ancestors because he thinks he has made money. None of you. I say none of you had the courage to caution him. Your Highness. Oh, shut up. I am still talking. Yes, Your Highness. I am not worried about that riffraff. Never! I am not. I am worried about you. Your questionable loyalty. Now, let me warn you. This is not the time to sit on the fence. No, it's not the time. This is the time to choose a side. And let me warn you, if you choose a side, no, you are finished. You are finished! Look at this throne. I said, look at this throne! Look at this. This is the throne of my fathers. This is the throne of my ancestors. This is my throne! And it is only when I die that someone else will sit on this throne. But let me warn you. Let me warn you. Look at me. Look at me. I am not ready to die anytime soon. <sighs> This meeting is ended. Go! Very delicate situation. I know. What should we do about it? Um, <clears throat> my fellow elders, no. this is not something we can discuss outside. The best thing is for us to meet in my house this evening to deliberate over it. Right? I think you're correct. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Of my people, the sacredness of tradition, hey, for the peace of my people, for equity and justice, I will fight for the throne of my father, the throne of my father, I will fight. Hey. 
Don't tell you that I'll be going back to the city tomorrow. But that didn't sound as if you wanted to go back to the city with your husband. He still wants to stay back, contrary to what we planned. I'll talk with him. Just give me time to do that. Okay, my queen. If you need anything, let me be the first to know. Thank you so much, my queen. That means a lot to me. Thank Welcome. you. Welcome. Dad, yes, sir. Where did you say we are going? Son, if this war assumes a dimension, which I think it would, then we will need more than guns to protect ourselves. You understand, don't you? Yes, Dad. Now I understand. Now, you said your friends are coming to town, didn't you? Yes, they are already in town and um, they like their status as friends of a prince. And um, they are willing to do any and everything in order to protect it. Exactly. And you know, Fred, before he will know what is going on, the war is over and he will be the loser. Yes. Yes. <laughs> You're a lion. Hmm? The chief of the old block, the son of the lion is a lion. <laughs> <laughs> You're my son. <laughs> Dad, you right. Uh, the right. more you don't know about it, better. 
Deli 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 Alele O te gu sri ba mala za mena na ka dia O te gu gali gali agwala nga gwa ni ba mala za mena na ka dia O te gu gali gali Ana ba na ti ejiram Alele O ja ni ba bu ni ba na bu na nzuzo My prince come over here My prince, you have been fortified. Mm. As you are rising, you are rising into your dominion. No man born of woman, no mortal can destroy you. You have been fortified. Rise! Go! <coughs> My fellow elders, we have an important situation on our hands and we've been part of it from the very beginning without our support our king wouldn't have been made king and now Fred is back to lay claims to the throne what do we do? oh no it's here. at this point the right thing we should have done from the onset was to consult the Zemo. I know that um, whatever he says will not be recognized by the king. As he stands now, I must confess that uh, I'm confused. Oh. <clears throat> Igwe made his point clear. He said we should take side. And I think that is the best thing we should do. Now, whose side should we take? That's the question. Hmm. Ichi OKK is right. Whose side should we take? That is the big question we should be asking. Whose side should we take? This year, we are still ignoring. My question is this. Whose side do we take? That's the question I'm asking. That is a good question. Let's be specific. Whose side should we take? Yes. <clears throat> Fifteen years ago, we went against our tradition and made the Lodibe king. I am suggesting now that mistake we made then, we should correct it now. Are you in any way suggesting that we should support Fred Ugezu? <laughs> Ichi Maduka. I said the mistake we made then, let us correct it now. My love, do you know that revenge takes away a part of you you can never get back? Yes. Why are you trying to scare me? 
I am trying to protect my husband. This is not about revenge. I only want to take what rightfully belongs to me. And the least you can do is to support me. Well, I am sorry if, if my advice doesn't fit whatever narrative you must have built for yourself. Okay? You want to fight fire with fire. But you don't have to be reckless about it. Really? Alright, we will have this discussion again when you become more reasonable. You are obviously turning into a leader. But I am more concerned about how you are handling the adjustment. Tell me, what is the order you are going to get what you are fighting for? I'm not thinking about odds. Tomorrow I am going back to the city. If you get the throne, um, you have my blessings to take another wife who will be your queen. I can't and I will never abandon my legal profession for your real convenience. I can't. Hmm. Okay. When I become king, we'll have this discussion again. I, the throne of my fathers, my throne and my bed right. The leadership of my people, the sacredness of tradition, hey, for the peace of my people. Where is your father? In his throne room. And where are you two coming from? Mom, I cannot disclose that now. Why? Mom, the less you know, better for you. I see. So you now talk to me in that manner. What is wrong with you? What has gotten into you? Anyway, your wife is angry. What did you do to her? Mom, I don't know what she told you, but I did not do anything to her. She wants us to go back to the city, but I told her it's not yet time. And what are you doing around here? When is it time for you to take your wife back to the city? Because you ought to have come back to the city by now. Mom, I think I'm done with this conversation, please. Jokes? Jokes! You're not the one I'm talking to. What did you tell my mother? Please, leave me alone. I need peace. What is your problem? Listen. Do not disrespect me by ignoring me when I'm talking to you. And let this be the first and last time you will report me to my mother! Only beasts beat up their wives! Do you think you know the characteristics of a beast? If you do not respect yourself, you will see one. Then you see one! Are you and what do you want? I am Congo, the head vigilante in this kingdom. All right. So what do you want? 
I'm here to warn you to stop disrespecting the king. You did not introduce yourself as the king's spokesman. I serve the king and the kingdom. And I, Congo, believe that you are dangerous to both. You won. Soon I'll be crowned king of this land. And when that happens, I'll make sure I flush out people like you. Whereas are very powerful. I suggest you choose your next one carefully. You know, being an idiot is really very easy. But the difficult part is convincing people that you're not. Next time I see you in my house, you will not like what will happen to you. What you say now, Waja? I wouldn't catch you. I just like back and come up by so. Is your cake and dog? You see, I got the regular money, get the lord, the laugh, or the lamp, or the quarter more of you alone, woman. You see, God like to your car, do you know my gab? Yeah. What you say now, Waja? I wouldn't catch you. I got told you, I didn't want me out there, man. I hope. What would I do? He love for. You see, hey, <clears throat> oh, Diego. Ah, you welcome. Yes, thank you. Hello. Um, is she okay, Keke? Hello. Our friendship started long ago. That's correct. And I cannot see what you will benefit. And shut you out of it. Of course, <laughs> I trust you. There's a plot going on. And indirectly, you are part of that plot. Plot? What plot? And, and how am I indirectly part of it? Good. I am going to make you the next Ono. No. I don't understand what you're saying. Uh -uh. You are confusing me the more. You are the only one we all know. And except you die, no one else can be the only one. So what are you talking about? <clears throat> Is she okay, Ken? Oh no. I'm going to be the next king. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Is it a kind of joke or something? <laughs> <laughs> Look at you. What exactly are you talking about? Um, let me be specific. The war at the palace between the king and Fred Ugezu will consume two of them. And when this happened, you know I'll be the next influential man to be the king. Are you with me or not? Uh, oh no. Tell me, how long have you been hatching this plan? And what are you really talking about? Long ago. You know, I have eyes and ears at the palace. Though, Fred changed the equation. I ask you again, are you with me or not? I think, um, I think about you. Say it again. <laughs> oh no. But I can't, I can't miss out in this kind of great plan that you're having now. I, I'm with you. <laughs> Good. Huh? I'm with you. Um, always have it at the back of your mind that you're going to gain if this excels. And again, this conversation did not take place. I understand, no. I think all this is understood. Very clear to me. Okay. 
cœur. I will see you at the palace in the evening. Hey. Yo, yo. Hey. Steve. Yes, boss. I'm still expecting you to change your mind and follow me to the city. Please, Mama. No, I can't. Okay, you don't go to this. Major, come not here, baby. Go. Be so well, daughter. Take good care of yourself. I will, and you too. Steve will drive you. Don't worry about that. I'll drive myself. Listen, I don't want you to leave the village and unhappy happy woman. Okay? Steve will drive you. My love. I'm okay. I'm happy. I'm fine. Just take good care of yourself for me. Alright. Steve, take this. Get in the car. Take good care of yourself. I will, Mama. Yes, <laughs> Mama, I'll miss you. Of my fathers, my throne and my bed dry, the leadership of my people, the sacredness of tradition, hey, for the peace of my people, for equity and justice, I will fight for the throne of my father, the throne of my father, I will fight. Hey. I will fight for my best right hey. hey. I will fight I will fight for my best right hey. Hey. I, hey, yeah. My son said he's going to. Mama, I don't know. He didn't say a word. He just rushed out like that. 
I'm surprised. Think you can run, eh? Choma <laughs> Jungwa. Serious now. Grace don't set now. Idiot. She been at me, they use the run up and down for the streets, have you? Today you will die well. <laughs> I don't mean it today. I swear I don't mean it today. <laughs> Boys. Take her inside, let us have our own. Fire! <laughs> When I know do and I saw an equi, I know do and I saw an equi. Only for quite beating your boy, you can book by him. Oh, chop by the tiny posse macana, Opera to Bullusi or Nick, and Niji Martin to the Bullusi Kayaka. What blessing on my jacket and on my jacket, but no matter of a condition on a target for that for. God's of our land. I thank you. I thank you for bringing the hair apparent to the throne. I thank you for making me not to look stupid before the king and the community. You have done it, and I know you will continue to do it. As a mono dialogue, 
Clark, my boy. Boss. <laughs> I hope you know you can kill with that firing a shot. <laughs> yes, boss. <laughs> <laughs> Boss, what's up? I hope she is still breathing. Yes, boss. She's still breathing. Because we've been needing her life for the second missionary journey. <laughs> <laughs> you mean? Direct now. <laughs> <laughs> what's up? <boss? laughs> Thank you, boss. Uh, hope you guys enjoy yourself. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Let me go have a bath soon. Are you sure that he will comply? It doesn't matter if he complies or not. I don't even intend to give him a breathing space. He has a deep pocket. You're doing well, my son. You must do everything possible to protect this throne. Yes, father. I have to go now. Sure. Good what is it? Father, do you have a hand in the kidnap of Fred's wife? What kind of stupid question is that? Father, Fred was here about 20 minutes ago. He was threatening to bomb down this palace if anything happens to his wife. Father, he had a gun. So, that idiot had the effrontery to come to my palace and threaten me. Mm. But Father, he was just trying to... No, oh, whatsoever happens to his wife, missing or kidnapped, is none of my business. He has no right to come to my palace and threaten me! Yeah. Don't go, my man. My prince. How are you? I'm good. How do we proceed? Your husband got you into this mess. See? Hello, Dad. What? Do not worry, Dad. I know what to do. Any problem, my prince? The manga went to the palace. What? With his stupidity. You have to escort her back to her house. With a warning note. Okay. Yes, my prince. Um, 
Boy, move this shit, man. coming to the house all the time. Why? People may see me and start suspecting. They will not suspect you. You are my daughter. This is her house. Uh -uh. Uh -huh. What is the latest? Anyway, Fred was at the palace today. Okay. It seems his wife has been kidnapped. Kidnapped? Though when he came, the king and the prince was out. So he told the princess to relate to the king that if anything should happen to his wife, that is going to burn down the whole palace. Okay, you are doing fine. Eh? Get more facts. Come your phone. Father, I don't want to be doing this anymore. I'm no longer comfortable. Uja na tozin. Uja gin na tozin. Ah, go up one low. Nothing will happen to you. Oh? No problem. I'll start going now before they would need me at the palace. Well, so what? But father, remember all this information. You will pay me. Oh, oh, so what? Oh, um, why they go? Oh, so what? They know um. You are a very wicked person. You are wicked. How do you love me in this godforsaken house? Eh? Now, yeah, please, I am not in the mood right now. Okay? Huh? If I've you already like. had enough stress, please. If you like. Why do I fix your mood? I don't care. All I want is that I want to leave this house. I am tired. Miriam, if I hear any nonsense from you again, I won't deal with you. You're talking nonsense. You will do me nothing. You cannot do anything. Are you mad? Stop me. How dare you stop me? How dare you? My love, 
and we are going to live long and impact as many lives as we can. Amen. Amen. And I promise to protect you with the last drop of my blood. Protect me? Mm -hmm. But there's not going to be a war. God will protect us. <laughs> and I only brings blindness. I love my daughter in law. I don't want to lose you. Pico, my young guy, please. I don't want to lose you. It was all my fault. It was all my fault. I shouldn't have brought her down to the village in the first place. See, this is not time to apportion blame. Blaming yourself will not solve anything now. Do not do anything. Only for you, am I right? Be cool. She did not understand, mother. You don't understand. She didn't want to come. I made her come here. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. I'm going to have a cable. Take your cable. Put one. Be cool. Put one. Put one. Just take a deep breath. Put one. Put one. If not, please, just try as much as you can to put yourself together. Because what has happened has happened. You can't walk on again. You want me to die too? Because you are Because. Hey. It shouldn't have happened in the first place. It shouldn't have Is she okay, okay. <laughs> No. We have a delicate development in our hands. Yes, I know. The question is how to go around the tradition. Because we rather go against the tradition than allowing Cyrus to become our king. Mm. I think we have a window of opportunity now that we can tap on. <laughs> yes. I'm listening, I'm listening. <clears throat> there was a rumor back then, okay, that the late Igwe Uzoma 
wasn't the biological father of uh, Salas. Okay. <laughs> but the rumor did not fly then. Okay. Because there was nothing to trigger it. Good. But this time around, okay, we are going to resurrect that rumor. Yes. And manipulate the situation. Use it to favor us. Okay, okay, you have a point. Mm. That is what we are going to do. No. We can't, a poor man cannot be our, be our oh, king. Oh. What does he have? Nothing. It's a little bit. Mm -hmm. But the man. You can say it again. <laughs> what I, what I, what I, what I, hey! Hey! Okay, okay. You have a point. Oh. Okay. Um, my fellow elders. Oh, no. Oh, no. I called this meeting for us to discuss how to bury our late king in line with our sacred tradition and to discuss how to crown the next king. <coughs> um, I know. I have a question. Go on. Why is Silas not in this meeting? To the best of my knowledge, and according to our tradition, he is supposed to be our next king. Oh. Then why is he not in this all-important meeting? And also, what is Chief Ilodibe doing here? Icho Kafo. I don't understand what you are saying here. Silas can never be our next king if you don't know, know it now. Ilo Dibe here is the main man. You better know it right now. It's okay, okay. That is a joke taken too far. It yes, <laughs> it's a joke taken too far. How can you tell me that Chief uh, Ilo Dibe will come from nowhere to become the king when we have a heir apparent to the throne? Because Silas is not the biological son of. Let King Ozoma tell him. Have you heard? Oh, <laughs> Have clear. you heard? It's a, big, it's a big shame. It's a very big shame. I was not here that no one will amount to. A child's neck can never bend in the market when elderly women are there. It's a very big shame that all of you who are supposed to stand by the truth have all sold your soul to the devil. It's a very big shame. Is your careful? What do you mean by that statement you just made now? That's an insult. Huh? What? You're insulting us. Oh no. <laughs> I cannot be part of this meeting. Count me out of this conspiracy. I am out. I will never support evil. We don't even need somebody like you here. Can you see him insulting, insulting? I don't know where he's even here. Oh, no. oh, don't mind him. Oh, no. Who is mind him? Let him go. Oh no. Eh? Elders. Yes. For what you have done here today, I am going to surprise you. Wait. Don't come here. Come here. Hey! Watch it. Don't go anywhere. Don't be careful. The meeting must continue. Who is Okafor? 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 Look at. What does he know? Who is Okafor? In fact, you know the way is a man. No man cannot be our king. All the time. Oh Diego, oh no what? Oh no, oh no, the giant. Just watch it. Oh no, you know the way. This is twenty million. Hey, 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 Hey. 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 We are going to have it. Look, you are there already. I have more. You are there. Where this is coming from, there is still more. Much more. Ah, Share this among them. Yeah. Whoa. I. Ah, greetings, my prince. As you come, I greet you. My, my, my prince, I am just coming from your house. We have met your absence. Is everything all right? My prince, nothing is all right. 
everything is not all right at all. What happened? You see, uh, 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 Mazi Ilodibe is planning to be the next king. And he's, he's plotting that with the rest of the, 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 the chiefs. Are you sure of what they're saying? And I'm asking them to come. See, as it stands, I angrily left them where they were planning to the, the burial of your father without your knowledge. That will not happen. Bam. I will not allow that to happen. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you, Mazuka. I'm going to fight for what belongs to me mm -hmm. with the last drop of my blood. Uh -huh. I will do that. Well, you see, you, you, you have to do that too. My prince, you have to fight too. Fight for your rights. You have to fight for your right to. You see, I am solidly behind you. If we will not allow these evil people to destroy our tradition, it will never happen. It will happen. Mazoka, thank you very much for bringing this to my notice. I'm so grateful to you. Let me be going. Thank you so much. Let me be going. Thank you. All right. I'm still angry about these people and their stupidity. Thank you very much. I am curious as to this your visit. I have made my stand clear. I can't support evil. I will never support evil. Uh, 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 look out for. Look out for one name. It is unfortunate that you see things from that perspective. Hmm? For crying out loud, this is a good thing that is coming to our family. Okafo, why can't you support me? You see, I beg you, I beg you. Uh, in fact, I see here, I don't want to lose it. If you don't have any reasonable to thing to tell me now, Walk out of my compound, Biko. Snow Lumpo, Biko. <laughs> I, I know that it is about money. I know that you have a lot of financial responsibilities. Hmm? Urgent, pressing financial responsibilities. And I, your brother, I have money. You see, I am aware of all your huge debts around this kingdom. So tell me, how much do you want? Listen, listen, let me tell uh, you. Uh, there is no need for you to say anything. Name your price. Name the amount. Well, you know me too well now. No, you, you know me very well. You know, all my life I have never received or accepted any bribe. And I will never do it. I am not ready to do it now. Or will I be ready to do it later? You see that throne belongs to Silas. And that is it. Mm, you see, before you came, I was busy at the backyard. I have to go back to what I was doing. You know, you know, Joe, you know, This is a surprise visit. Stop calling me Prince because you have not recognized me as one. Eh? What are you talking about? I know what you people are trying to do. You want to install Ilodibe as the king, the next king in this particular village. No, how could you do that? You and your mischief elders had the effrontery to discover my, about my late father's burial behind my back. It's a shame. Prince, please, let's go inside. Let's go inside and discuss. Huh? I'm not here for your hospitality of anything. I'm here to tell you that I know what people are planning. And it will not work. I will not make it work. Excuse me.
Your Highness. Your Highness. Your Highness. You want to take what belongs to me? It is not possible. Uh -uh. Your Highness. I I don't want to take anything that belongs to you. Um I am only Listen here. Just listen. I am willing. I am ready to defend my late father's throne to the last drop of my blood. Your Highness, it has not got to the point of issuing threats. That is the point here. Whatever plans you have with the others will fail. It will not work. Uh, Mazio Kuro, you're welcome to my house. I now have a collar. Yeah, I have to go to the house. Hey, hey, okay, the collar can wait. In Africa, I'm going to be a little bit. When two elephants fight, glass cannot be made there. I am not at war with Ilodibe. When the war starts, you will know. Do you understand? Wait. It, the, when the war starts, it's going to be between Ilodibe and the gods. Uh -huh. The tradition is very clear about who succeeds. Okay. okay. What I want is peace. There will be peace. When the elders the because the tradition is very clear about who succeeds the oh. Oh, what is yeah. uh -huh. okay. I know what oh, 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 I say you should leave my compound now. Just leave. leave. Because I can see you have, don't have anything reasonable. Mazo, can leave my house? Are you sure? These are the informants. We have come to discover whether I'm going to do something or not. Uh, who, who is there? Come and carry this collar. What is it? What is it? Where do you think you are going to? Oh, Agent of Doom. Stay out of my way. <laughs> you cannot stop what has been destined to be. Oh, Jadeli. I'm not going to be in the end. I'm going to be in the end. I'm going to be in the end. Listen. You know nothing about destiny. I will not be here. Allow you and Elodibe spit on the face of our tradition. <laughs> Let me tell you, you are going to remain here until Elodibe is crowned king. I invite you to try. You don't need to invite me because I am here to stop you. I thought you said you are as a more. <laughs> Move, let me see you. You are going to remain here. Move. Hey! Oh, Jadi, Leo, Jammo, Oh, Jadi, Ke. Hey! Oh, Jadi, Leo, Jadi, Ke. You can't hold my phone. Um, my fellow elders. Oh, no. According to our tradition, Ezemo should be here. 
But due to some circumstances beyond his control, he sent me a message directing me to announce that the next king will be Chief Ilodiba and will be crowned the next Ekede. Igwe in the making. As I led. Oh no. Igwe. Igwe in the making. Because of our land, I've been deprived of what rightly belongs to me because I'm not financially privileged. I've been deprived of what really rightly belongs to me because poverty is my friend. Ghost of our land, I'm not asking you to fight for me. Ghost of our land, I'm asking you to fight and protect my son. I want him to be very rich so that when he grows up and becomes very rich, nobody's going to take him for granted in this village. Ghost of our land, make my son wealthy and protect him when he becomes a wealthy man. Ghost of our land, Ori, you are my witness. Afro, you are my witness. Nkwa, you are my witness. Eke, you are my witness. Ah, Ghost of our land is painful to me. It's really painful. Have you dug the grave? Yes, my prince. Then you have to go and take the body. Make sure you're not seen. Okay? Yes, my prince. So. What is it? Father Fred attacks me. Fred attacks me at the gate. You mean that rat had the effrontery to attack you? The crown prince.
that boy is biting more than he can chew. My, my husband. Keep off this matter. This is men's affair. So you have finally reduced me to nothing in this palace. Of course, you are nothing. Father! I see. How can you talk to your wife in such a manner? Right in front of your children, father. Are you out of your mind? Are you? God. Father, we need to end this once and for all. We have to call Congo to use my men to end this once and for all. Yes. I will call Congo. Together now, Pico. Cool. I'll stay back. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Steve. Steve. Let's go out. Take my watch to the park. Oh. Okay, boys. Watch for me. Okay, boys. The throne of my father, my throne and my bed dry. The leadership of my people. The sacredness of traditions hey, For the peace of my people For equity and justice I will fight for the throne of my father The throne of my father I will fight hey, I will fight for my birthright hey, I will fight Yeah Whoa. I... My prince Can you please give us a minute? What is it? Why is Miriam your wife? I've asked you severally about her. You keep saying she's fine, she's fine, she's fine. Yes, she's fine. Then where is she? For two days now, I've not seen her. Miriam is my wife. So you shouldn't bother yourself about her. Well, she's my sister-in-law too. I should bother myself about her. Okay. She left for the city early this morning. And she didn't tell me. She told me because I'm her husband. So, go and get married. That will make you learn how to mind your business. Okay? 
Did you just say that to me? Hello? Yes, go ahead and talk. Okay. Thank you for the information. Hey, lock my door. He must be hiding somewhere close by. Let's look for him. Yes. Let's split out. You, stay with him. You, come with me. This way, this way. Shoot me. You will gain nothing by killing me. Quiet! Else I will split your brain on the floor. <laughs> Look, I don't know why I'm doing this. I want you to run away from this community. Run very far, I don't ever come back. And if I see your face around this community, I will do what I'm paid to do. Thank you. <laughs> this way. He escaped. What? Guy, anytime you tell me you shot him twice, you'll still miss him. Yes. Mother. I really do not understand what is happening. I don't. The news everywhere is that father and Chooks kidnapped and killed first wife. I don't understand. Princess, I found myself in an unusual position of not knowing what to say. My dear, your father is capable of such horror. But my problem is how your brother changed overnight. <sighs> um, Mother, that reminds me. Did Miriam tell you that she was leaving this place? Yes, she told me. Do I appeal to her to stay a little bit longer? That was why I was surprised when she told me she had left for the city already. There is something wrong somewhere, mother. There is something not just right in this palace. Something is not just right. How can Miriam live here without telling you why? How? I am yet to solve that puzzle. So many unanswered questions. 
I wouldn't know. Mother, a maiden quarry. And my findings made me to understand that father took the throne from Fred's father. That is a result of my findings too. So it is a confirmation. My son, huh? I have been looking for you. There's fire on the mountain. I know. I saw it. Swallow it. Over a chunk of the chow, over a chaddy canana. Over a chaddy canana. Over a chunk of the chow, over a chaddy canana. Fred Rick. You didn't just choose to run battle. But you also chose the wrong man to mess with. You choose somebody to mess with! Oh no, I am not in the mood to see anybody. I'm sorry, Your Highness. I'm here to remind you that my loyalty for you can never depreciate. I'll be with you in bad and good times. Please, let me go. Oh no, Your Highness. Come. Thank you. Sit. <clears throat> oh no, Highness. I am not a good king. Your Highness, to say that you are a good king is an understatement. You are the best king this kingdom has ever had. Oh no. Minus. Then why are the people not revolting against the man that wants to dethrone their king? They are good king. Why? Your highness. You give me an idea now. Just give me authority to mobilize people against him. Yes. Oh no. Your highness. Can you do that? I can do that. Consider it done. Oh no. Your Highness. You have my permission. Thank you very much. Consider it done. I will do that. Let me be on my way.
you want to lose your life? Do I look scared of you or your evil master? Huh? Do I? Go back home and tell him the battle is over. Tell him that war is coming his way. Wow. Impressive. Well, things have changed. I want to fight by your side now. You want to fight by my side? Yes. Why? Yes, you spared my life back there. But I cannot trust you. You don't need to trust me. But in time you will. I don't know why I spared your life back there. But I quickly realized that I've been on the wrong side of history for so long. I have lived by the gun and soon natural law will take its curse. And before that, I, Congo will love to set this right. <laughs> to win this war, you need an army. Yes, an army. And if you think King Ilodibe is evil, <laughs> think again, for he is worse than that. It is time to stand for something, even if it will cost me my life. Go, go. 
by the princess. Hey, princess! 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 Hey! Hey, princess! Run, 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 run! We are finished. Hi. We are in big trouble. Big? We are in big, big trouble. Big trouble. What do we do? We can't even go back to the palace without the princess. So what? If you go back to the palace without the princess, we are dead. If you remain here, the king will find us. We are dead. Ah! So what do we do now? Eh? What do we do? The best thing we should do now is to just look for sniper and take our lives. Bam, you are right. That is exactly what we are going to do. I'm always right. Eh, we just we, let's just drink it and die now. Nah. Eh, ha, ha. What? I never, I've never in my life liked this princess for one day. Lie, lie. My brother, I've never liked her. That is not the problem. Whether you like the princess or not, it has nothing to do with me. But me, I'm not just ready to die yet. At least not now. Now nah. I'm still very young. I can't die now. Ah, but wait. Why would the princess trick us like this? I, I don't know. Ah! I don't know. Hey! Ha! Ah. Mogwe, I'm finished. I'm finished. You just can't go back to the palace. I'm finished. Eh? Yeah? I'm God. finished. What do Let's we... just exercise a little patience. Maybe she will return. Eh? Yeah. Uh -huh. You think so? Well, that's the best option. Eh, hey, we'll wait now. At least it's better than drinking something and, uh, and then end up dead. Ah. Who's there? Things from the royal home. It's the princess. Princess. Let her in. What do you want? Over the loss of who? Sympathize with who, you bloody asshole. You people killed my wife. And you have the gods to come in here and mock me under the guise of sympathizing with me. Get out of my compound. I said, leave my house. of my people, the sacredness of tradition, hey. for the peace of my people, for equity and justice, I will fight for the throne of my father, the throne of my father, I will fight, hey. I will fight for my birthright, hey. I will fight 
I will fight for my patriarchy. Hey, 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 yeah. Come, let's go. Hey! Hey! Yo, yo. Hey! 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 Long live your highness. Take this envelope. Take it to your father immediately. Yes, your highness. There is something important he will do with it for me, so be fast. Yes, your highness. Now go. Yes, your highness. Oh no, you think you are smart. You want to be king. I don't have a problem with you wanting to be king. But my problem is that you want me dead. So you can become the king. You planted your daughter in my house so that you can get information about what is going on in the palace and you think i will not find out oh no you think that the fox will not find out hmm? <laughs> <laughs> I will not kill you. I just want to play music for you. Hey, come on, hey, come on, come on, hey, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come Hey! Um, 
Our people say that Onye Babo Olo Megini Olacha Oloma Ichi I am going to reward you exceedingly For revealing the plans of the late Ono Wu to me hmm? You did well I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. I want to make this pronouncement. Neil. Yes. Henceforth, you shall be known as the owner who of this kingdom. <laughs> Right, right. I will never remain loyal to you. Of course, I know, I know. Our people were right when they said that Onye Babo Lomegini. Olacho Loma. Igwe, I appreciate. Thank you very much. I know. Tomorrow, I will inform other cabinet members of this decision. Hmm? Yes. Oh no, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a very good one. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Ah, they will hear it. Oh, I know, I know. Rise. Ah. Hmm? Go and enjoy your new status. I want to travel to Enugu for my friend's birthday. I'll be back tomorrow. Go. Oh, son, you can stay as long as you want. <laughs> Thank you, Father. Mm. Ah, you know, the battle is over. Father, I do not think so. Right. I don't think that Fred is coming back to this community again. It is only a madman that will dare us. Hmm? We gave it to him real hard. <laughs> Let me ask you. Has he buried his wife? I do not have an idea. I think he must have buried her in one of the burial grounds in the city. That serves him right. That serves him right. Hmm? Listen. If he dares us again, if Fred ever dares us again, we will resurrect his dead parents from the grave and send them back to the grave again by killing them. Father, I think sometimes she sounds funny. Anyway, um, I think you might be needing my maid since Congo has disappointed you. No, I don't need them. Take them with you. Take them. It's all right. It's all right. Let me go and get prepared. I'm still in shock with what's happening in this community. How can the Onu Wu and his daughter just die like that? My brother, that marvels me. Who could be doing all this? My brother, 
Are you not in this village? Mm -hmm. I'm suspecting the evil king. Cry! Mm, what are you saying? See, now listen to me, eh? I hear no evil, I speak no evil. Excuse. There's trouble. What happened? Fred is back. What? I'm afraid of the huge crowd that is hailing him as moves. It's okay. Thank you for the message. You can go. Yes, you can go. Yes. Father. Sir. We didn't see this coming. There is no need to panic. We are going to end this today, once and for all. The leadership of my people, the sacredness of my people, I greet you. We greet you too. Are you sleeping? My people, I greet you. We greet you too. I greet you too. I thank you for your immense support. May the Almighty God bless you. Amen. May the Almighty God bless you. Amen. This war is our war. Ilodibe must leave that throne. Yes. What did I say? Ilodibe must leave that throne. Yes. In addition to killing his way to the throne, Ilodibe has no leadership qualities whatsoever. Ilodibe killed my wife all because of power. And I said that I will honor my wife with victory. That is why I have not buried her. Is Ilodibe stronger than all of us here? Yeah. Is Ilodibe stronger than the people of Umunze? Yeah. Is Ilodibe stronger than everybody here? Yeah. That is why we must end Ilodibe. We must do what? End Ilodibe. We must do what? End Ilodibe. Thank you. He brought tears, he brought suffering, he brought pains to this land, to the people of Umunze. But my leadership.
worship will be different. I will bring joy. I trust you too. It's from mother. <laughs> I love you. To prove it to you, just a little, a little show of love from me. More will be coming. One We have a FIFA, we have a FIFA. My king, I'm all ears. Ojadi Lindsay, my enemy has come back with spiritual powers. I am fast losing my confidence and influence over my people. I need you to do something fast. I need to be fortified the more. <laughs> my king, your enemy has just entered into the river he cannot swim. Millionaire, he will be drowned. My king, do me a favor. Go on your knees. Deli, deli, deli. Deli, deli, deli. Manakele, bugele. Manakele, bugele. Manakele, bugele. Manakele, bugele. Hey! Rise, my king! The prince himself! On your knees! Rise! Go and show to them who the king is. Anybody who refuses to honor or respect your throne, show them terror! Yeve wu ebubagu! Give them terror! Enye mwana fezu mike! Ewe! Mwaba tu legu, mwaba tu legu, adama tu legu, atu lo! Inye! Uwo! Hey, what do you 
to apply the carrot approach first just to win people back on our side how do we do this okay father see just organize a ceremony give it a name make it mandatory that so people will comply then we'll share gifts more than the ones um, Fred shared. Why doing that? We are planning on how to bring Fred down. I think we will do this. Hmm. Um, Father, one more thing. More oh, years. Okay. What do you think you do to? Mama and the princess, you know they are practically not on our side. Oh, both of them. Yeah. Now we we'll put them under house arrest. Put them under house arrest while all this is going on. Then you have to give strict instruction to the guards. You know my sister is very, very, and extremely smart. <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> I know what to do. Invitation. 
and a special celebration in his palace. If you do not come, you will be considered as an enemy to this community. Okay? Then your wife too. Great people of Umuze, listen to this special announcement. Our Igwe, His Royal Majesty, His Royal Highness, Chief Cosmas Ilodibe, is inviting everybody for a special celebration in his palace in the next seven days. If you do not attend this celebration, you will be considered as an enemy to this community. If you hear my voice, explain to others. Great people of Umuze, listen everybody. Our Igwe, His Royal Highness, Igwe Cosmas Ilodibe, is inviting everybody for a special celebration in his palace. In that seven days, anybody that does not come will be considered an enemy to this community. You know the man. Come out, you coward. Mom, come out! What is the meaning of this madness? Come and pay homage to your new king. Get out of my palace! Get out! The other time I was here to warn you, I was not prepared. Right now, things are different. Once again, I give you seven days to vacate the throne. Seven days? Hey, hey, hey! Do you know what you are? You're just an overgrown baby elephant. That is what you are. Steve, tell this boy that when men are talking, boys stand aside. Tell him. When men are talking, you boys want me to young again at all or make a boss or to young again at all. Chiso, that's why your face is like this. What is the problem? You didn't get the clothes you went to get. You know, that's that's that stupid tailor. Refuse to give my clothes. I don't mind listening to you. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, you see it? You see it? Now you're regretting. I keep telling you to mind the kind of tailors you give your clothes to, but you wouldn't listen to me. If you go near, who knows the way you just sort of handled your clothes? Hey, but that reminds me. Are you going to attend the invitation at the palace? Which invitation? Instead of me attending that party, I rather attend friends charity program. It's you. Oh, hey, man. Uh -huh. Hey. Hey. Uh -huh. Hey. How could I have forgotten this? Hey. What am I Well, so the girls they're not back yet. Greeting your highness. Greeting my friends. Your highness, we were searched everywhere, we couldn't find them. But I left an instruction that no one should allow them in this palace. Yes, your highness. Hey, shut up. I have a bigger problem in my hand right now. When I am done with that problem, I will deal with all of you. Get out of my presence. Yes, Father, what do we do? Don't worry about them. We'll worry about them later. No. Father, we don't have to underestimate anyone, especially the princess. You know, she's acting as if she's hiding something. Son, a woman cannot be the king of this kingdom. 
So whatever else she's hiding right now, it is inconsequential. These people are there now. Right at the village square. Fred has gathered the people at the village square. In fact, what they are doing there now, I, I, I can't understand. That's why I said we should hold it there now. He's hosting all of them. Oh no, are you sure of what you are telling me? Very sure. Very, very sure. You, you will see that when we get there. No places around I, I was wondering when I looked at that. People saw that he was just throwing money and if, I, if you see the situation, you won't believe your eyes. That was said, let's rush there now and see how we can quell that situation. Okay, the hurry up, hurry up, son. Hurry up. Fred is, Fred is crying. Fred is taking more than he can chew. He's biting more than he can chew. He's daring a lion. He's daring me. I have to do something. Hurry up, son. You're on it. The rat can only boast in the absence of the cats. Unless you are only a magini. Nobody would ever call a cat a mopose waffle. Nobody would ever call a cat a bona. But the name on a gum mopose waffle. Hey, go and show them who I am. I am a daddy look at a mother calamo. Yes, yes. I was a lithian elema. I was a lithian elema. Mobade wow. Mobade wow. I babu. Gabadu. Gabadu. Ujedia. Ujedia. I tell you. Daddy, 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 I am a No mortal can stand my powers.
One no 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 gigi. Gigi ne gu. One no no ne gu. Otu ba ba ya si na boso ne aga one ya yeji. Amarisa ubo isa we ni ni. Manogu ni amu. Isusu ya no no. Hey, God's of our land. The time is now. The battle line is drawn. We are ready. Follow us. Lead us. And give us victory today. Kaigan obum. Kaigan obum. Mo kaigan obum. Imane jimofo. Natural noz ebua nozo. Kaigan obum. Oh, nyangwa. The battle is ready. Hey, Hey, Hey! Princess, princess, you betrayed your father. You will pay for all your sins, father. You killed too many. How can you be this heartless? How? Officer, she is my daughter. She is sick. She is very delusional. Don't take whatever she says, okay? All right? Arasin! Move! Wait, officer. So, officer, wait. I'm trying to explain Move. to you that... Us. Who are you? Come with me to where? Come with us, guy! What's up? Uh, yes, same there. The only question you are permitted to ask, if I ask you to make a jump, you will say how high. They feel me? No, 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 no reason I'm over. Okay, sure, that's it. I mean, you know. See, I don't know who you are. Just stop this rubbish. 
It's annoying the mood for this. Hey, sir! Uh, uh, I, I didn't tell you they, they join here. I said, man, come with us very fast. They do. Come with us, guy. On the cheap. I'm more happy for you. Do with me. Wow, what did you? Brizo, Brizo, Brizo. Hey guys, my guys, what did happen now? Nothing much. Just the, nothing much. Just the on the low. No, 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 no. That's a, that's a G spitter. My guy, my man. Be your guy. I don't know these people. They wanted to force me to wherever. I don't know. Uh uh. Guys, why now? So, you know how the game be now, you know how the game be. Why do they behave like this now? This man a perfect gentleman. Maybe not free him. Free him, 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 free him. Please, I'm based on you. Yes, yes. Uh, no, 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 I suppose you wanna, you know how they be. I got it, okay. What's up, man? Um, I'm sorry, my name is Chooks. I'm from Orifte. Orifte? Yes, my father is a King Ido Dibedi I. Wow, wow, yeah. wow. <laughs> Funny. Now, the world is not as big as people think. Why did you say that? My name is Fred. I'm also from Orifte. Wow. Then you're my brother. <laughs> yes, uh, wow. Nice one. Nice meeting you. So, where are you going to? I was actually on my way. Um, to just the junction, let me pick up something uh, before, before your friends. Okay, actually they're not my friends, just that they respect me enough around this place. Oh, really? Yeah, okay. so they accord me that respect, okay? Whatever I ask them, they do. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, I'll drop you off, okay? Alright. Nice Thank to meet you. you. Thank you once again. <laughs> thought about the festival. Yes, and next thing I noticed, I, I kept on thinking about the nightmare I had. Did you pray about it? Oh, yes, I prayed. I said a short prayer. Since then, I've not been able to shake off the feeling. We may have to stay back. Baby, if you want to change your mind, I would be delighted because I never wanted to go in the first place. But before you do that, remember that Prince Chuka and his wife will not be happy about the decision. Oh, I'm confused. Baby, the moment is our shield. My love. Baby, what is it? <coughs> Nothing. You are not a good liar. You've been cold since we left the palace. Please, tell me what is going on.
something about the king. I, I can't lay my hands on what it is exactly, but something. Something like what? You know that look people give to you when when they're hiding something. That's exactly how he was looking at me. <sighs> the festival will take up to eight hours. And a day after tomorrow we are off to the city. So you don't have to worry the way the king was looking at you if he has something to hide or not. Yes. I think you're right. <laughs> See? That's exactly why I love you. Super smart. Very intelligent. And I love you more. Now it's time for you to refresh. According to the tradition of Ireland, you must marry before your crown can. I've been married. It's just that I lost my wife. We understand what you are talking about, but your wife must be at the coronation day. She must be there in order for her to be crowned the queen of the land. So you must have to take another wife. Well, my wife is late, as you both know. Her body is still in the mortuary. It's been barely three months since she passed on. For me to remarry, at least I need to mourn my wife for one year. One year. So if this is going to be a problem, considering our tradition, I suggest that the throne be given to the next family in line of succession. I say this with a clean heart. Well, we have to consult Dezimo on the matter. I am leaving you for good, Muse Kingdom. of our land. Unless he dies, he's still the next king. But great one, he, he, he said he, he will not remarry until after one year. Then the throne have to wait 
until it's ready. Please sit down. Thank you. You're welcome. Right, that makes you were close by when you called me. Oh yes, uh, I was actually in the neighborhood. I came to see a friend of mine who owns a shop not too far from yours. Mm. So I decided to stop by and find out how the princess is doing. Right. <laughs> Please stop. You know that um, I'm no longer the princess, so why you call me princess? Mm. Okay, that's a story for another day. <laughs> so how are you, how is business? Well, I'm beautiful. Business is fine. You're trying. Thank God. <laughs> okay, let me not take too much of your time. I know you're a very busy person and you love making money, so, <laughs> so I'll, I'll just leave. But before I go, okay. please, how about a date this weekend? Listen. Fred, not again. <laughs> last one. After this one, no more dates. Right? <laughs> Okay, Saturday. Fine, thank you. Time, 8, 9 p.m. 2 p.m. 2 p.m. Lunch. Thank you. Hi. You look good. Thank you. Okay, as you know, I'll be crowned soon. So I'm currently assembling my team, um, people, um, people of like minds, intelligent, smart, uh, dedicated, hardworking people who love our kingdom and are ready to work you know, to make our kingdom better. Yes, I'm assembling a team of such people and I'm actually considering you as one of them. Me? Mm hmm You. Okay. <laughs> well, I do not know much about our tradition. But what I do know is women do not have a place in leadership in a tradition. Well, I understand. Uh, you're saying this because it's been like this for a while. But in my own kind of leadership, women have a place in it. Hmm. Interesting. Educate me. All right. Anytime you see a king, a true king, who's got knowledge, wisdom, leadership, skills, and the fear of God in him, look closely. You're going to see a responsible woman is actually behind the scene pulling the strings. A woman. Hello? Hi Fred. I'm fine, thank you. I'm um, Fred, I want to ask you a favor. Take me to the altar. As the chief custodian of Umunze Kingdom. According to our customs and tradition, it is only the heir that succeeds the throne. Of what benefit will it be to the gods 
if they fail to perform their duties as to protect their very own, nothing substitutes experience. The only way to see reason as reason is to reason reasonably. The gods are wise. By the powers bestowed on me as the Ezemo of Umun's kingdom, I hereby crown you Ochiaya one of Umun's kingdom. Woman of truth, there is a saying that behind every great man there is a virtuous woman. By the power bestowed on me, as is the more of in the kingdom, I hereby crown you, Lord, Lord, Adaki Bia, in Jesus, in the kingdom. Can we now go outside to continue the celebration? <laughs> of my people, the sacredness of tradition, hey, for the peace of my people, for equity and justice, I will fight for the throne of my father, the throne of my father, I will fight, hey, I will fight for my best life, hey, I 